In today's video, I'm going to show you how to make this delicious ravioli in white creamy sauce. So let's get started. To make ravioli here, I'm using this kind of ravioli. These are uh, spinach and cheese. Uh, actually comes in a two pack like that. But I'm going to use only one pack today because which is enough for us. So again, these are spinach and cheese ravioli. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to cook um, ravioli first, like just like a pasta. So just boil them about three to four minutes, or you can just follow the instruction provided in the back of the um, package. So I'm going to cook that first, and then we will start with our um, sauce. This is how they are looking. So, so as you can see here, I have water boiling for uh, my pasta. So into that, I'm going to add salt. So I have added salt and now I'm going to drop my ravioli's in it. So I'm going to boil this until they're ready. Let's prepare our sauce. So for that, I'm going to add butter. This is like about four or five tablespoons of butter. Let it melt. Right, so my butter has melt completely as you can see. So now if you want to add anything else like fresh ingredients like garlic or mushroom, you want to add it right now before you add your flour but I'm not going to add any other um, fresh ingredients into this so I will start adding my flour so I'm going to add about five tablespoon and you want to mix it very well make sure there is no lump okay just like that and now make sure everything is well combined the flour and butter so as you can see it's getting thick so you want to lower your heat and let this cook until you smell or you see there's flour is changing the color getting a little yellowish to brown all right so my flour is ready it's getting brown as you can see you don't want to burn this so now it's time to add a milk or a cream so here I'm using one and a half cup of milk which I'm going to add add slowly and keep stirring it you don't want lumps so you want to keep stirring it it will get a little bit lumpy but you want to keep stirring it and it will be lump free and now I'm going to add a little bit of cream This is optional. You can only use milk or cream. It's up to you. And now we're going to season this sauce. So I'm going to add a little bit of salt. Then I'll add a little bit of black pepper. Just like that. And I'm going to add garlic powder. And a little bit of Italian seasoning. That's it. Mix it again. So now this is completely optional, but I'm going to add a little bit of chili flakes to make it spicy. And I'm going to add a little bit of Parmigiana cheese. That's it. And our sauce is ready. I'm going to add the ravioli. It's ready. I'm going to add my ravioli in it. Carefully, you don't want to break it. Okay, mix it carefully. You just want to make sure that your each ravioli is covered with the sauce. And I'm also going to add a little bit of mozzarella and cheddar cheese. This is optional. Okay. Mix it. 
mix it and you want to enjoy it while it's hot because if it's get really cold then it's gonna get thick so enjoy it fresh and while it's really nice and hot right so we're Rebel is ready to serve so let's serve this and I kept the sauce runny because I know it's gonna get thick in like few minutes because I'm not going to eat it right away so let's serve this all right so this is my ravioli ready to enjoy and I hope you have enjoyed watching this video and if you did please 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 like this video subscribe to my channel and share this video with your friends and family and I'll see you in my next recipe till then bye bye